Hi guys! So I thought I would come on and show you the finished junk journal that I made and I'm sorry if you can hear that sort of whirring noise in the background but it's a fan and without that I just would not be able to live at the moment in this heat so it's got to stay on I'm afraid. So we'll start with the cover. So this is what I've done for the front cover. And with hindsight, I would have actually made that the back cover and made that the front cover because I like the back so much more than I like the front. But anyway, on the back, there's these like raggedy roses that come in a strip. And then I've got this applique going all the way up the back. And then on the spine, I did what I said I was going to do and I placed on the um, white rose trim on there and then on the front is some golden rope that came in one of the lovely Deja's packages and some lace I think that also came in a lovely Deja package and some of this trim here which also came in a lovely Deja package <laughs> and a little rose applique there that um, came from a what you Americans would call a thrift store what I would call a charity shop so open it up and we've got the first page and it's just been printed on there with a stamp and it says up here it says journal. I've tried to use in this all embellishments that I've been given. Um, so this came out of a lovely Deja package, this beautiful blue butterfly and I thought it went fantastically with this blue here. It just sets it off really nicely. And I popped another little applique butterfly here. So if we go, the first page has just done some stamping. I've also put in a bookmark, which says, which came off of a pair of boots, it says genuine leather. I don't throw anything away, so <laughs> I used that. This is stamped with a love stamp and the definition of love. Then we come to the next page and there's a embellishment that somebody gave me and a tag that I've been given as well. And then in the next page I've put this paper on and a, I think the, that Colette made this for me, yes. And then this tag that somebody made for me into, goes in behind there. And then I made this myself with um, some texture paste and a um, stencil. And there's just a plain tag in there. And then on there it's just some ink that dropped on some paper. I was using it as blotting paper originally, so I tea dyed it and that's the result. Then in here we've got one of the lovely little dress forms that um, Avril made and there's that and then there's just printed page again and here oh two pages stuck together it's just this stuck on here and it's just a tuck spot and you can fit a photograph behind there but literally just a photograph will fit behind there to come down so that you can see the photograph in there and then on the next page it's just plain so left for journaling basically and in here we've got tuck spots and tuck spots and this is the Alice in Wonderland from the Alice in Wonderland CD and I think that Colette made those and there's another one of the dress forms that Avril made and just another tuck spot there and a little pocket there for the other side of the envelope and there's the other side of that um, paper that the ink blotted on it there's another paper page there and then I've left quite a few pages just blank I thought well it's a journal you've got to have room for journaling haven't you so yeah there's that page there with just a little um, someone special written on top of there so you can pop a photo on there of somebody special or whatever another one of those photo mat pages a little tuck spot there with an envelope so you can pop something in there, plain pages, some more plain pages, a page with like a wooden effect on there, a tree trunk wooden effect on there, another little tuck spot, 
and another printed page because I absolutely love this stamp it's amazing I think I got it at a charity shop and another piece I used a, the whole of a wooden paper pack to do this with I think it was the capsule elements wooden paper pack there's another tuck spot and obviously you can get inside the envelope there so yeah more plain pages across here that's another one that Colette made and another I think I've just stuck that down completely on there because I liked it too much and there's a little tag there that somebody's made for me open that out and there's uh, some more blotting paper that I use for um, blotting ink on and another little pocket there and you keep going and there's another one of the photo map pieces there that you can pop a little photo down behind and it's got all the dogs and cats on another couple of plain pages and another couple of plain pages and I've stuck that one down and you can pop something in there another blotted photo page and then couple of wooden pa wooden pico fours and the another wooden page and a brickwork page so there are three signatures all together and yeah that is it basically that's my book so if you like it guys stick your thumbs up if you don't then don't and i will catch you again next time oh if you haven't subscribed already please do and i will catch you again next time all right i've been tammy bye bye now